Okay, that's looking better. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yep, well, live drop frames is zero. I needed to reboot. Magic of modern everything. All right, let's jump into it. that produces the most spice will control doom. There are no set territories and no rules of engagement. Vast armies have arrived. Now, Three houses fight for control of doom. The noble Atreides. The insidious Ordos. And the evil Harkonnen. I get the shiver down my spine when I hear that. It is such a cool intro. They don't do that anymore, like they used to. Um. So, what do I do here? Who should I be playing today? You pick. Okay. What I will have to do then is to put my keyboard into autos mode. Which is ridiculous but fun. Alright. House autos. Uh, this is just 107. So it's got some of the basic fixes from the 90s, but none of the modern major fixes. Yeah, I considered playing that, but I, I felt like something 
Um, you know, I wanted something nostalgic for myself. I'm not actually going to play with that, so move that out of the way. So. Acknowledge. Report. Acknowledge. Yes, sir. Moving out. Yes, sir. Moving out. Construction complete. Sorry, my mouse is doing some strange things here. Much better. Moving out. Warning, enemy unit approaching from the east. Report confirmed. Yes, sir. Infantry out. Construction complete. Affirmative. Yes, sir. Moving out. Reporting. Yeah, I'll, I'll check that out at some point. I'll check that out at some point, but some... Acknowledge. Yeah. So, this is Dune 2, this is the first asterisk RTS, um, there were some games released beforehand that could kind of be called an RTS, um, but this is the game that had sort of most of the, this is the first game that had sort of all the features, um, you know, multiple missions, the, the entire game is these missions, you run around, you earn credits, Shoot things. Construction complete. Uh, build structures, destroyed. build units with the structures, and then go and destroy an enemy base. Construction complete. Um, this game, of course, is Dune 2. The first Dune was actually an adventure game that came out a matter of months, I think, before this, and is completely unrelated. Reporting. Enemy unit and was made by a different studio and everything, so they're, they're completely Affirmative. separate games. Um, Affirmative. Following Reporting. the success of this game and its Reporting. format, Construction complete. Westwood then Enemy somehow came up with their own, uh, their own intellectual property, which was of course the Command and Conquer series, which everyone on the planet Reporting. has played. Affirmative. 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 So yeah, as the precursor to Command and Conquer, you'll notice that there are a lot of a lot of weird things that this game does that later games don't. Features that later games have that this game does not. This game is kind of the definition of first installment weirdness as a trope. There's a lot of weird stuff going on. What, what you'll notice straight up is that I'm only selecting one unit at a time. There is no, you know, I'm clicking and dragging here. There's no selection box for multiple units. Um, every unit must be moved on its own individually, which sounds pretty arduous. Sounds arduous, but due to limits in the game, that kind of helps because there's only a small number of units that you can actually build by default. Um, Yes, fortunately there are keyboard shortcuts, otherwise this would just be an awful repetitive strain injury simulator essentially. Um, it's also helpful that the maps themselves are not huge. Uh, the AI is fairly simple, it's a relatively simple game. Yeah, there's a lot of, yeah, there's some things like that. So shooting, shooting this game is obviously from the unit that's firing to the unit it's attacking. Um, but there is something strange where shooting straight up and straight down creates, uh, results in the most amount of damage. Shooting diagonally, I think is the least amount of damage. Except I think if you're shooting diagonally up or down, I can't remember which is also full, but it's very, very strange. Um, what you'll see me do a fair few times is arrange my units. You might have noticed me doing it before, so that they're directly above or below enemy units. Okay, diagonally up is definitely not it. Yeah, 
Yeah, I think I think diagonally cool. down is the it actually gives you the same damage as shooting up or down straight. Acknowledged. So now that he's damaged, so this is uh this is where this feature started. When a unit is damaged, it starts billowing Reporting. smoke. Affirmative. Reporting. No? Deployed. Okay. Acknowledged. Acknowledged. Yes, sir. Moving it. Report. Affirmative. Reporting. Warning. Enemy unit. Well, let's try this. Diagonally down. Yep, moving out. Ah! Okay. Unit destroyed. Acknowledge. 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 Report. Acknowledge. Acknowledge. Okay. Affirmative. Affirmative. So that also is more or less fixed for Command and Conquer and later games. Um, I say more or less because there's still a bit of, uh, I guess, overspill for certain units in Command and Conquer. Yeah, exactly. Tanks. I, I think it's basically anything with projectile weapons in, um, in Command and Conquer Red Alert. They don't, they don't damage entirely the square that they're firing on. It's, there's, I guess it's kind of like a little bit of splash damage emulation, or simulation rather. Yeah, well, CNC one did it. <laughs> Not just better. Affirmative. So what you what you see me do at the moment is discovering the map. Um, I don't think this game invented the fog of war. Your mission is complete. We'll get back to that. So something fairly unique to Dune 2, and I think the first Warcraft game as well, was that in the first mission or two, you could win the mission just by gathering a large enough amount of resources. So for example, in uh, Dune 2, you harvest more than a thousand units of uh, spice in the first mission. You... Okay, I played a bit earlier. <laughs> you, um... You win the mission, and in the second mission as well, if you gather 2,700 units of spice, same thing. Man, there is a lot of there is a lot to talk about with this game. Yes, I do know that. I have seen that. Um, I plan to do a playthrough of all three houses. I'll do that in at least one of them. Now, something else this game is perhaps infamous for. Is its copy protection. So. The answers to all of these, so these are, it, it's like a library of randomly picked questions every time at the end of the first mission, at the end of the eighth mission, I think, out of nine. It asks you a question about the armor level or the armament of a structure or um, or a unit, and all the information is in the manual. So I don't know that I've shown you this yet. This might be interesting, but and I even did a special thing with OBS to do this. So. Long story short, I found a copy of this game on eBay. Um, it's lovely. I, I, I adore this box art. This is beautiful. I need this as a poster at some point. Um, it comes with a manual itself, which is great. Lots of yeah information on each of the, uh, the structures and some of the units. This, 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 this copy is a little bit worn. It has to be said. Um, it also comes with the discs. There are four discs. 
see how good a shot I can get of that. It's pretty cute. Um, and a bunch of, I guess, promotional nonsense from the 90s, which I won't go too into because we are playing the game now. What do we want? We want the armor level of that turret. So... Alright, turret, armor, heavy. Now the funny thing is, uh, as a kid, for one reason or another, we didn't have this. So basically for these questions you had to guess. Uh, some of the questions are fairly easy. For example, this should just be... Where am I typing? Into the game. Um, when it asks for more complicated things, so for example, um, the armament, where it says 105 mil cannon, it wants that string. It won't just accept... Hang on. What is the camera doing? Okay, should be automatically focusing. So if I hold this fairly steady... So where it asks for a particular string of text, it wants that string. Um, some of the answers were easier to guess than others. But I thought it would be fun to just pull out the manual basically and do it the old-fashioned proper way so we'll switch back um, so that mission briefing was just well done now you must earn 2700 credits of spice uh, it gives us the same very small map uh, but with a big difference, in this Reporting. mission there is also an enemy base. Um, if you destroy the enemy base and all enemy units... Is it? No, it is just the base. Um, winning in Dune 2... If you destroy all enemy structures, you win. Doesn't matter how many units they have still firing at your base, for example. Um, I'm not going to do that because that is particularly hard to do for autos. Uh, simply because the autos way is lightness, speed. It, it's not super difficult, but it's more than I feel like doing on a Sunday morning. I'll put it that way. So I'm going to play this mission fairly differently to the way I did the first. The first mission, you can only be attacked by a handful of enemy soldiers. Yes, and I'm avoiding, I'm avoiding putting concrete down, which means that my structures start at 50% damage already. Um, so this game, this is a feature that disappeared from later real-time strategies like Man and Conquer. Uh, the story of Dune essentially is it's a planet, it, we're far off in the future. Uh, this planet is covered in spice, which is extremely valuable. The point of the game is to harvest the spice and then take over the entire planet. Uh, so we will eventually get into some combat. But for now, I'm being sneaky and avoiding it. Um, avoiding building concrete just makes it a little bit faster to get these structures up. I think I will build. Gosh, excuse me. I will build a second refinery so that we have two harvesters out and about. Yeah, and it does affect things a bit, like for example, uh, refining spice will be a little bit slower. 
um, based on a sliding scale of how much uh, damage the refinery has. But power doesn't matter. The only thing having power what really affects is whether um, your radar works or not. So in... Yeah, it was introduced in Command & Conquer, the first one, where... Um, no, it affects more than that. Ordos Harvester deployed. Ah. Well, in that case... There you go. Here, look. I'm feeling generous. I'll bring it up a bit. It is more expensive, but I'm playing this tactically, so I'm not bothered by the cost. Yeah, it's... Again, I think that comes down to early installment weirdness. This is... They hadn't really balanced that out yet. And there was no multiplayer option for this game at that point, so... Um, Playtesting was limited, in a sense. So now we play the waiting game because because I'm choosing not to fight, I am reporting, reporting, gathering credits. So each harvester reporting. can gather about 700 credits worth of spice in a single go. Then they trundle back to the refinery and convert that to yeah 700 credits. So we're just under 800. Reporting. 14, 21. So these harvesters will have to Reporting. come out, Reporting. we'll have to finish their run, come out again, finish the second run and come back, and then we should be done with this mission to get up to the 2700. Oh, here's a fun little bug. If you have a harvester uh, selected and it runs into a structure, or really any, any unit that you have selected and it runs into a structure, whether it's a, a a harvester returning to a refinery or a repair facility, uh, you end up with this little square instead of the whole thing. No difference to the gameplay, it's just a fun little bug that I like Order to play with. Harvester deployed. Reporting. So. Warning. Enemy unit approaching oh, no. from the east. Okay, I wouldn't call that the east. And that's hardly... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, dear. Right, the other thing about this game... They introduced limited storage of resources. Construction. So each refinery holds a maximum of a thousand spice. Um, I need to reach 2,700. I have a max storage of 2,000 here. I need to put down a silo. So now I have a total capacity of 3,000. I can actually finish. And what do you know? We have just enough power to do this. Reporting. 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 Not that damage through low power will have enough time to make any difference to this mission. Reporting. Reporting. So. Reporting. What else? What else is there to talk about? This is the mission where you're meant to start building uh, the radar outpost, so you can actually see on the radar minimap. Um, this game, was this the first game to have like an in-game in, in sort of radar thing? Because the way it works in this is, by default, you only show... Oh. Yes, sir. Infantry report. That's Affirmative. deeply unwelcome. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Yes, sir. Moving out. By default, yes, the radar just shows Moving black, out. and then it'll only show your structures. 
But if you build a radar outpost... Yeah, we should be good. This guy's full. And we're about to finish. So you build the radar outpost, you have enough power for it, and you see actual... Your every healing on the map. Complete. Your structures, the terrain, your units, enemy units, enemy structures as well. Once you've cleared them, uh, made them visible through the fog of war. That music. So, scoring in this game is both convoluted and meaningless. Um, it is a formula of the amount of spice that you harvest in a mission, the amount of enemy units and structures that you destroy, but also a countdown for a timer. So, I think it starts at 90 for the first mission and then adds 45 minutes for every subsequent mission that you start. And then the final score is that time minus every minute that you spend in the level, plus every bit of spice that you harvest and every structure that you destroy. And it's pointless, really. Okay, so... Now we've been given the attack quads. I was not going to bother doing combat with these, Reporting. which are the Raider Trikes. Which are like normal trikes, except really, really fast. And... Yes, They're not even glass cannons, they're just glass. Construction complete. Report affirmative. Report affirmative. Where the hell is the spice? Construction complete. See, I was kind of hoping you wouldn't tell me to go autos, because the autos missions are a little bit harder. And generally more annoying. Yeah, you, you did this to me. Oh, really? Where is it? Construction complete. <laughs> Reporting. Acknowledge. Acknowledge. Reporting. Acknowledge. Construction. Yeah, but early star point is because we need it. Reporting. It's not an advantage, it's a construction complete. A coping mechanism. So we seem to have our own private little spice field here. How's the sound on everything in the stream? Is it all decently listen toable in terms of volume and clarity? Because I haven't actually streamed with this uh, headset before. Construction complete. I've used it in a couple of uh, work Reporting. meetings. Acknowledge. Construction complete. Because my work headset had some uh, through some tantrums, shall we say? Yes, out. Report. Acknowledge. My colleagues were also very, very entertained by the fact that this headset lights up. Yes, sir. Out. I forgot to turn that off um, before the first meeting that I joined. So they were quite amused by that. Affirmative. Construction complete. Reporting. Acknowledge. Construction complete. So something else that you'll see me doing is for any unit Reporting. whose movement I care about, like if I'm scouting, complete. I will try and keep it in view, in frame, as much as possible. The reason for that 
construction. is because when they developed this game and ran it on the computers at the time, which was a 486 essentially, uh, they had to do a lot of little tricks here and there to keep it running at a reasonable frame rate because this game was groundbreaking for the time. There was, you know, you, you didn't do this with a computer and a video card and so on. Um, Get the wood trap built because I'm sick of dealing with concrete. Reporting. Spice bloom located. Damn it. Okay. Report affirmative. Acknowledge. So to get around one of those limitations where they realized, oh hang on, it takes a lot of processing power to update the positioning of units um, all the time. Some bright spark said, hey, units that are off screen, because we're not looking at them. We can make them move slower, and nobody will really notice. Construction complete. Result of which is that if we were looking at that track that's at the top of the screen, at the top of the map, it should be in the top corner by now. And it is not. Reporting. Warning, worm sign. Okay. So the first web on the map just makes this loop around here and isn't really going to threaten us just yet. I don't know if there's a way around the concrete, uh, or around the rock. We will find out. So... Let's build the radar outpost just so that we can see what's going on. Reporting. And I'll continue clearing the fog of war from this map, bit by bit, with a track. Affirmative. Construction complete. Radar. Activate. Oh, that is supremely oh, unwelcome. Yes, sir. Moving. Yes, sir. Moving out. Yes, sir. Infantry reporting. Acknowledge. Acknowledge. Reporting. Affirmative. Acknowledge. Acknowledge. Reporting. Uh, no. Attack him. Yes, you draw his fire. You guys are useless. Enemy unit destroyed. Report. Affirmative. Ah, it'd take too long. My harvest is busy. Construction complete. Enemy unit destroyed. Reporting. Affirmative. Warning. Worm sign. There it is. So the reason it's telling me worm sign and then it's not appearing on the radar is because it'll be appearing on like a square of ground that I can see. Reporting. Um, and then immediately disappearing. I wonder... Reporting. Can we trap the carryall? find out he'll orbit a bit yeah he's kind of orbiting we might have trapped him uh crap 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 crap, crap. Report, affirmative report acknowledge report acknowledge warning a trades unit approaching construction complete so, yeah. Construction complete. Affirmative. Yes, sir. Infantry. Yes, sir. Moving out. Yes, sir. Moving out. Yes, sir. Moving out. Construction complete. Enemy unit destroyed. Construction complete. 
Yes, sir. Ruben. Yes, sir. Enemy unit destroyed. Yeah, Report. I could do. Warning, worm sign. But there's micromanaging and then there's micro micromanaging. Construction complete. Right. So, this is a feature that I don't think really made it into other games. Um, having placed the light factory, which builds light wheeled units, um, I can build the raider trike straight off, or I can upgrade the structure for a certain cost, so that I can build the heavy attack quads. Reporting. And yes, the structure must be at full health for you to upgrade it. Otherwise, it'll just show repair. Affirmative. So, Reporting. they didn't do that in Command and Conquer. Affirmative. They also... Oh, hello. Yes, sir. Oh, I've got a trooper. He got dropped somewhere. Okay. Moving out. Warning. A trade's unit approaching. Okay. It's been a long, long time since I've played Gordos Harvester an actual Command and Conquer game. Construction complete. Yes, sir. Gordos unit destroyed. Infantry out. So we should now be able to build quads. Don't need much power. Construction. Enemy unit destroyed. Construction complete. Construction complete. Great, my first one of these. Acknowledged. Oh, this is beautiful. Construction complete. So construction complete. Well, early game AI complete. and pathfinding. Because this enemy quad is trying to attack something up here. Um, because this bit of mountain... Worm sign. Oh, come on. Oh, and they're actually going to do the same thing. <laughs> okay. So what's happening here is because these units... These, are just, these guys have just been dropped behind my lines. Um... Because the structure that they are trying to attack is behind other things that are in a direct line with their target, uh, they're not in range to shoot at it, they don't have the smarts to walk around it, so they're just going to stand there. Same thing is happening with this quad, I think he must be going for, from that angle, possibly this wind trap, because that's been attacked before. Uh, but he's stuck and he's going to stay there. Not engaging in battle with anything, because the yes. trooper here that's shooting him is out of his range too. Warning, a trade's unit approaching. Report Ignat. Yes, sir. Moving out. How? Yeah. Okay. Reporting. This level's going to be cheesy. But I'm okay with that. At the end of the day, this is the game that it is. It's buggy. Oh no! What's happened? Oh, because he's... attackable. This, this game is broken. 
I didn't expect to see brokenness Reporting. this bad this early on. Um. Acknowledge. Construction complete. Border unit deployed. So, I am just gonna build an army. Construction. Now there's a sandworm there, so. Sandworm. Reporting. Affirmative. Acknowledge. There we go. Report. Acknowledge. Affirmative. Acknowledge. And because angling these units down here leads to the fastest damage, we'll just do this. So, I mean, this is not a speedrun. I'm gonna have to do something about... Yeah... So what I was saying was, this is not a speedrun. But, if this was, I'd be taking advantage of this stuff anyway. This is just the way that the game played genuinely back when it was new. Actually, do enemy units count against the unit cap? Because if they do, I'm just going to leave those guys there. Because that's two units that the enemy does not have. And it could be the same with having a trike stuck here, but I need these guys here to defend against infantry as well. So, this has just turned into a much more casual playthrough. Um, I don't think I'll bother exploring the entire map. See, this guy's focused entirely on the base. He's just dis he's just appeared from over here, uh, but because none of my units shot at him, he's not bothered. Started to slow. I'm just gonna up the cycles a little bit. Enemy unit I don't know that it drains enemy credits to repair buildings, though. I don't think it did. Alright, we're also gonna take advantage of another bug, which is that enemies, uh, units that are damaged and smoking. See an extra tile uh, of space when they move around, which is really nice for scouting temporarily. Which means we now move this army down here, unit by unit. Now the version of this that I grew up playing was uh, even older than this, and enemy structures were not rebuilt when they were destroyed. Construction complete. 
Photos unit deployed. Photos unit destroyed. Enemy unit destroyed. Enemy unit destroyed. Yes. They're doing that in this one as well. I'm I'm actually kind of scared to play the 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 major bug fix version that you mentioned earlier. Just because I know it'll be that much harder. Um, and from the description of it, from what I've read, I actually expect it to be, yeah, much harder as you say. Um, which is not what I want. So I would be a lot happier with that. Um, this game having those features if it was easier to play overall. And now I know that there is a remake. Uh, there's a couple of different remakes actually where people have basically taken the resources from the game and uh, I'm now getting hit by the same bug that the enemies at my base are getting. So I'm having to very carefully maneuver my uh, units around here. So they can actually, yeah, these guys are not firing at that thing at all. Even though they're within range, um, the range that he should be able to shoot, because they need to hit the top left corner of the structure, if they can't reach it, they don't damage anything. Enemy unit destroyed. And we now have this ridiculous mess where this guy is going to stand there and... Oh no, no he's not, okay. Uh, good old Yitzhak Jumath. Um, this guy's actually going to go to that corner. And take that, that quad with him. Why aren't you shooting? Warning, a trade's unit approaching. Reporting, acknowledge. Enemy unit destroyed. Affirmative. Enemy unit destroyed. Acknowledge, report, permit, report, acknowledge. Enemy unit destroyed. Enemy unit destroyed. So I'm sorry if I'm going to go quiet at various bits through this. Oh, this is... Okay. I'm not too bothered about trying to attack these units. I am just going to... ...destroy as much as I can here. What? Oh no, these guys have just woken up too! Uh, I'm not going to let my quads get stuck into that. And I should have been looking here because my, my units have just been destroyed. This attack has failed. In a sense. Unless... No. Okay. It is time to rebuild. Enemy unit destroyed. What's this guy doing? Unit destroyed. Construction. Okay, so basically their their base defense strategy has just overwhelmed. Um, my attack force there. My harvester is doing nothing because the spice is just one square out of his view. He's gonna attack, get attacked by these guys in a moment. Anyway, um, apologies if I go silent for a bit, just enjoy the music. I am trying to think and coordinate a battle that is frustrating. Um, oh dear. 
They're gonna attack him. Construction complete. Reporting. Acknowledge. Reporting. Oh, we have a spare truck up here. This guy's still alive? <laughs> that goes to show just how slow things happen when they're not on screen. Construction complete. Bordos unit deployed. Permanent. Uh, Enemy unit destroyed. Reporting. I never built that second refinery, so my income is not where it should be. Construction complete. So I'm just going to keep building these from the one factory. I was going to build a second, but... Uh, I think this is enough units. Reporting. Acknowledge. Sweep Reporting. down and ambush this factory. Reporting. Acknowledge. Reporting. Acknowledge. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledge. Reporting. Affirmative. Report. Affirmative. Okay, that takes care of that. Go after the barracks. Reporting. Affirmative. Report. Acknowledge. Reporting. Acknowledge. Reporting. Acknowledge. Report. Reporting. Affirmative. Let me move him Warning, a trading here. Approaching. Report. Acknowledge. Acknowledge. Ha! Destroyed. So now, because he's here, destroyed. neither of these trikes can hit him. They're going to shoot through their own building to try and get to him. Reporting. Reporting. Six destroyed. to quad down. Reporting. May as well let these guys shoot out these last units here. Right. Attack the outpost. Attack the outpost, please. I am going to ignore the cluster of blue that I can see on the radar at my base. Because um, I destroyed these last two structures and I've won the mission. And I get to move on and have tanks. Which makes combat so much less annoying. That's it. Your mission is complete. It is if they attack the thing that I want them to attack. I really should have cleared this list so that I can show the progression. Oh, clearing the list automatically advances the screen. Okay. Good to know. No, you don't need sleep. Reporting. Look, I'm up to this mission. I've got tanks now. Or will do. And I can build more than one bit of concrete at a time. Yes, sir. Move it. Reporting. Acknowledged. Reporting. Construction complete. Report. Acknowledged. Reporting. Affirmative. Report. Reporting. Acknowledged. Construction complete. Affirmative. Okay, I've accidentally picked a really good map here because I'm far off in the corner. I've got a whole lot of. Construction complete. Uh. Private spice, shall we call it? Yes, sir. Moving out. Construction complete. And now I get into a phase which is 
at least for me, Morning. it's unique for Dune 2, which is kind of base design paralysis. So, unlike in Command and Conquer, where you have, you know, the entire map essentially, oh, this is beautiful, this is a great map. Glad I picked this one. Affirmative. Unlike Command and Conquer, where you can place structures anywhere, uh, in June you can only place them on rock. And ideally on concrete that you've built on rock. Reporting. Acknowledged. Now... Affirmative. Spice bloom located. Another thing they hadn't thought yes, of yet Moving in June, yes, which they Perfect. did for Command and Conquer, was having the ability to place structures uh, one square away from your your uh, your existing structures in concrete. Because I can place this here because that's adjacent in concrete. I can place it here because it's adjacent diagonally to the wind trap. I can't place it here. So base design paralysis. You end up thinking, oh, I could put a, a three wide structure here and then a two here and then a three here. I am going to build radar next. Bordos harvester deployed. Acknowledged. So that really becomes more and more of a thing, especially in later missions, where they get a little bit craftier about the size and shape of the rock that they give you to start on. And you have to be very careful about what you build and when and where. Warning, worm sign. Uh, they might have been randomly generated back in the day, but for June 2 at least, they are very pre-done. Where is this worm? He's actually there. Report, acknowledge, reporting, affirm, report, affirmative. Let's reporting, just get this guy out of the way. So the reason the sandworm is here is again primitive pathfinding. He actually wants reporting. probably this trike. Because it knows it's on sand over here but there won't be an easy way across. Bordos Harvester deployed. Finally, there he goes. Report, 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 report affirmative. Now. I never actually really played with um, MCVs reporting. Report, as a kid. Um, Report, acknowledge. Report, acknowledge. I never felt the need to expand Report. my base beyond the rock that I had in a way that would be economical and useful to win the game. Acknowledge. Construction complete. Report affirmative. Construction complete. Except for when Almost I wanted to cheese it and put, you know, rocket turrets up to the enemy base, sort of thing. Report affirmative. Acknowledge. Construction complete. Now. Construction complete. And yeah, but at this point I'm just putting down concrete. This is more base design paralysis. Because I know within a minute or two I'm going to get a surprise attack. Some enemy units are going to be placed around the base. And 
replacing something of high value, for example, a tank factory, is risky. Complete. Because the moment it's placed, it can start taking Recorded. damage. Acknowledged. Construction complete. What do I need next? More wind. More power. So... Heavy factory is going to go down here, I think. Wait, is this... Can I get turrets in this mission? Not yet. Next mission. Reporting. Acknowledge. Acknowledge. So enemy base placement isn't super consistent. Uh, like, there's no consistent design language, I guess, about these missions. Um, because my base is in the top right corner, I'm guessing the enemy base is going to be somewhere from here Auto down. It'll be roughly opposite, but not entirely. Um. Alright, so we need to build the light factory before we build the heavy factory. So I'm going to pop that probably here. So that I can put the heavy factory. Oh. Construction complete. Why did the music change? What's going on? Nothing. Nothing's going on. So yeah, this game is one of the first to have atmospheric music like that. Like if you, um, if enemies started appearing and attacking your base, you'd get more interesting music. I'm not going to bother to upgrade this one, um, because now that I've built a light factory, I can build a heavy factory. I'm just going to do it. I feel like I'm early enough that the first attack isn't going to have a tank in it. Gosh, excuse me. Yes, sir. Reporting. Oh no, it might have been the sandworm because I just spotted him on radar here. Affirmative. Okay. So actually, if I rush to build the heavy factory and put a tank on the ground. Because I've laid so much concrete, uh, because a tank runs faster on concrete than it does on rock. You just want to watch me squish troopers, is that is that what this is? This is the entire reason you, you're watching this stream, is to watch me crush Reporting. enemy infantry and troopers. Acknowledged. Construction complete. Gordos unit deployed. Bloodthirsty weirdo. Alright. Gordos harvester deployed. I am particularly hesitant to put something here yet. Because if the enemy gets dropped up here, Construction. A, it's harder to get to around the thing. Especially with this one wide passage here. Uh, and B, if I tell my tanks to attack it, they'll end up shooting at the thing that I put there anyway. So I try to have as condensed a base as possible initially to avoid things like that happening. Construction complete. Report acknowledged. Report. So I'm going to place Construction complete. Tank over there. Going to start building this out a bit cuz this is going to be um Construction complete. Uh spy silos. Yes, moving out. Construction complete. Construction complete. And I'm gonna start placing them because Oh actually. She built a couple of harvesters too. Now that I can do that. 
Or should I? Construction complete. No. Because my plan is to change to put have, uh, another two refineries down here. Construction complete. Because if I build two more harvesters, this lot will go very quickly. Um, and I'm going to have to start manually managing harvesters a lot earlier than I really want to. Until we get to the mission where we can build the high-tech factory, which gives us the ability to build carryalls or a starport. I can't build a starport yet, can I? No. Construction complete. Okay, there is something very odd going on with my mouse. Sorry, bear with me a moment. Construction complete. Warning: the trade is oh no. approaching. Our base is under attack. Acknowledge. Atreides troopers, eh? Border harvester deployed. So, I like wireless peripherals until they start doing other things. Much better. Reporting. Affirmative. Uh, I have a lot of money. I'm just going to start building techs. And some more refineries. And I'm gonna keep. Reporting. Oh, hello. Construction complete. Ordos unit. Deployed. Can I keep you? Reporting. Construction complete. Sometimes this works. Sometimes it doesn't. And by this, I mean when you get reinforcements dropped in, they're dropped in by carryall. And sometimes if you... Their other main function is to ferry harvesters to and from spice fields. And I don't think I, I, don't think I captured him. If you, sometimes if you tell a harvester to return while there's a carryall still flying around from when it reinforced you with the extra units, sometimes you can trick it into staying on the map and being a free carryall. Um, and that's a huge bonus if you do that. But it looks like in this case, that was not successful. So, I'm going to place down some more power now. And I'm not going to bother building infantry barracks, because that's just... They're a useless unit at this point, now that I have tanks. Infantry in Command & Conquer was a lot more useful, a lot more versatile. Um, and more varied as well. So, for example, there were reporting. engineers. Acknowledged. Report. Who... Reporting. Yes, sir. Oh, moving okay. Because I have yes, this sir. line of units here. Moving out. Reporting. My tank's not moving. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Reporting. Can move that tank up there. Reporting. This one over here. Border harvester deployed. Warning: a trade's unit approaching. Put that there. So this game doesn't have engineers. Reporting. Affirmative. Report. Acknowledge. Report. Uh, that Affirmative. role, Reporting. the role that they fulfill in Command and Conquer, is basically fulfilled by regular infantry. Affirmative. But because they're so slow and weak, the and moment that they destroyed. Uh, they're very easy to, to kill, essentially. Alright, the attack has begun. Acknowledge. 
Warning. Time to move my tank into my tanks into a line. Construction complete. Enemy unit destroyed. Bordos harvester deployed. Reporting. And then send a bunch of other units off on suicide trips yes. just to scout. Moving out. Yes, sir. Enemy unit destroyed. Acknowledged. Acknowledged. Some of them may die, but that is a sacrifice I am willing to make. Acknowledged. Warning. Worm sign. Affirmative. Acknowledged. Reporting. And then this one little track here is just continually discovering this block of nonsense. Reporting. Reporting. Acknowledged. Okay. I can't create any more units because I've already built out to the maximum number. Reporting. So this is the other reason to send these guys out on suicide missions to, to construction. A, not just discover stuff, but B, also get destroyed. Maybe do a little opportunistic damage. And then get destroyed. So we can build more things. The other, other good thing is that sometimes, depending on what the sandworms are up to, Construction complete. Unit deployed. Uh, deployed. sandworms will grow after any of your units. Unit destroyed. They will also go after some enemy Reporting. units, if they know they are there. Enemy unit destroyed. Reporting. 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 Acknowledged. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledged. Yeah, a lot of them are just in, uh, I guess, guard mode, and then once they, once they are uh, discovered, and destroy the unit that picked them up, yeah, they never get replaced. So they get disturbed, they go get killed at your base once they've destroyed the thing attacking theirs, and it sort of depletes the, uh... No! Oh well. The spice must eat my trike. Yeah, this is true. I prefer doing it with trikes because I can get interrupted and walk away and he's still discovered a ton of um, a ton of new terrain. Plus because they're just scout units, they're more expendable and I can, you know, they're a lot less annoying to replace than a tank because they get replaced with a tank rather than replacing a tank with another tank. So I guess this is the dull phase of the game? Yeah, they are. They shouldn't be, you know, one and a half times the, the price of a, an ATV. <laughs> a little quad bike. On the other hand, if you make... I mean, how do you, how do you correct that in a game that's balanced like this? Because you can make the tanks more expensive, which means you end up sending out a harvester, you know, 
one load of spice gets you a tank. Yeah, okay. I think I've set up a bit of a hornet's nest here. So let's actually join these two into a bit of a scouting army. Does it? That that's a very niche thing to happen. Team Purple has joined the... They got dropped over here. Warning, worm sign. Very weird. Affirmative. Report acknowledged. Enemy unit destroyed. Acknowledged. Acknowledged. Okay, that is good knowledge. We'll attack from the north. Affirmative. Because their construction yard is there and quite uh, vulnerable. Opportunity here. No, that's not a good opportunity suddenly. Oh, and here's the heavy factory. Okay. Perhaps we take a two pronged approach. Um, I won't attack yet, because I've only just stirred up the enormous angry hive. Like all of these are about to be uh, annoying. I'm kind of playing this like I essentially like I played it as a kid. I like to reveal the entire map. And then do my thing. Enemy unit destroyed. Acknowledge. Affirmative. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Enemy unit destroyed. I like to have like a, a clear view of everything, I guess. No no no. Acknowledge. Reporting. There we go. Affirmative. Enemy unit destroyed. Acknowledge. Affirmative. Re affirmative. Acknowledge. Enemy unit destroyed. Reporting. Fine, here's the squish. Warning, worm sign. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledged. Report. Acknowledged. Affirmative. Was it good for you two? Acknowledged. Affirmative. Acknowledged. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Construction complete. Ordos unit deployed. Reporting. Acknowledged. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Affirmative. Ordos harvester deployed. Oh. Time to repair everything. Ordos harvester deployed. And because the ambush attacks have happened, I can probably reporting. Construction complete. Enemy unit I'm gonna leave these guys as is. Because they're just micromanagement now. These guys are still finishing up. Um reporting. Enemy unit destroyed. Yeah. Hence the repair a thon. 
You know what? I've got some concrete here. Unit destroyed. Construction unit deployed. And some tanks. Bordos harvester deployed. Construction complete. Enemy unit destroyed. Look, it's my spice. I'll do with it what I want. Oh, I guess I could have led the tank into that spice blue. Oh well. Another weird thing this game does is deselect a unit. And it's a very consistent thing. If you command a unit to go somewhere, and then recommand it while it's moving, It deselects the unit. Reporting. Affirmative. Acknowledge. Affirmative. If you Acknowledge. if you do like this and redirect it fairly quickly, it doesn't do that. Report. Acknowledge. Reporting. Oh, mostly. Acknowledge. It's 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 fairly consistent. I think it's it's consistent enough for me to feel comfortable playing with it that way. I'll put it that way. Enemy unit destroyed. Affirmative. Time to move the lineup. And some of them up, up. Enemy unit destroyed. Construction complete. Enemy unit destroyed. Enemy unit destroyed. Report. Acknowledge. Report. Now that the main attack waves have gone. Yeah, there's a couple more that we can build because we still have uh, this trike and a quad. So I'm gonna have this quad, uh, this trike, annoy some things down here. He can go on holidays. Now, these guys should be enough to take out the construction yard. What are we looking at here? So we get one tank. There'll be enough to take care of the construction yard, and that's all I care about at the moment. And then the infantry barracks doesn't matter because it's completely enclosed. Great map design. Um, they won't... Maybe they can run down here and kill off the light factory? I don't know that they'll get there. Oh, it's damaged. I mean, let, let's see. Let's see what I can do with five tanks. reporting. 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 Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. This guy doesn't care. At all. That his construction yard is being destroyed. Enemy structure destroyed. Enemy unit destroyed. Up. Oh. Okay. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledge. Reporting. Affirmative. Oh, now he notices. Alright. A unit approaching. I'm gonna go straight for the light factory. And then the heavy factory. Enemy unit 
Five tanks in a dream. Let's let's make the most of this. Go over, we'll go after damage stuff. Time spent in reconnaissance is seldom wasted. Enemy unit destroyed. Am I gonna win this scenario with five tanks? Enemy unit destroyed. No, I'm not, because when I go for this, the, that'll be just close enough for these guys to notice. But everything up here. Maybe. Yeah, this game is broken. Unit approaching. All right, I want to bring my other tanks in, but if I look away from this, these guys will slow down their rate of fire and this won't get destroyed. So now we wait. And then we can just steamroll with my entire collection of defensive tanks. Enemy structure destroyed. Acknowledge reporting. Let's go straight for the front door. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledge reporting. Acknowledge reporting. Affirmative reporting. Affirmative reporting. Affirmative reporting. Acknowledge reporting. Affirmative reporting. Affirmative. Right. Enemy unit destroyed. Reporting. Affirmative. Uh. No. Reporting. I can't do that. I can't select them. Hey, look, I've got a harvester selected. I'm now clicking. You can see me clicking. It's not happening. Um, I should probably pay attention to what I'm doing now. Yeah, I was doing that, and it's not. So this quad here? Unit destroyed. Enemy unit destroyed. No, that's not selecting it. Enemy unit destroyed. Do I have to have nothing selected? Maybe. Affirmative. Enemy unit destroyed. No. Enemy unit maybe something funny about the version I'm using. Report. Affirmative. Report. Acknowledge. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. I feel like I suddenly have a lot fewer tanks than I did a moment ago. Squish. I mean, you might not be. I am kind of remembering the same thing happening in the past. I might aim to do one more mission and then I might call it a day for streaming. We'll see how this goes. Enemy 
structure destroyed. Enemy unit destroyed. Not necessarily, I'll just waltz in with another five tanks. Yeah, true. Reporting. Affirmative. Report. Acknowledge. I might actually. Enemy structure destroyed. Your mission is complete. They are, and you can defeat their entire usefulness in the game by putting a quad out. The downside of jokingly turning my keyboard into a battle pad entirely for this game is that, especially for this keyboard, the um, keys that aren't lit up are very difficult to see. So the point of that cutscene is that in the game you are doing well enough that the Emperor himself is starting to become annoyed and doesn't want you to win. So in that mission uh, he actually supplied a couple of extra units to the enemy. Uh, they appeared as purple. Um, they had no effect whatsoever because a couple of troopers do nothing when you have tanks. And it's a part of the story that the Emperor gets more and more uh, opposed to you. I'll put it that way for now. Alright. So new stuff in this mission. We can build the high-tech factory so we can build the um, carryalls now which means spice harvesting will be a little bit better. A little bit less annoying, less tedious. We can build turrets, which are the basic base defense things. Uh, these are useless against these, the missile tanks, or rocket tanks as this game calls them in some places. These have ridiculously long range um, and will easily outrange the turrets. So if you get one of these near your base and you don't expect it, uh, you're probably going to lose some structures in the time that it takes you to mobilize something to come around and deal with it. But they are laughably inaccurate, as mentioned, and they have a minimum firing range as well. So if you attack them from really close range, like with a tank, you drive a tank all the way up to it, um, or even a trike. You just tell a trike to attack it. It is completely immune from a missile tank's... Um... I suppose I should have lit up the U key as well, because I am using that. Now... Do our initial scouting. complete. Acknowledge. Affirmative. There is the spice. Affirmative. There. Acknowledge. Acknowledge. Spice blue located. Construction complete. Can I build a starport yet? No. Construction complete. 
what am I going to do here? Construction complete. Yeah. Acknowledge. Acknowledge. Because the real shame about not getting um, missile tanks in this mission Acknowledge. is that I would instantly swap to scouting with them rather than quads and trikes. Because their vision distance is ridiculous. Oh, I thought I was all the way over. Acknowledge. Reporting. Affirmative. Report. Affirmative. Affirmative. Now, I'm not going to scout too far out. Acknowledge. Acknowledge. Affirmative. Because our base is Reporting. fairly far into... Complete. Like, we're not in the corner. We're fairly far into the middle of, this, of the, uh, the map here. Reporting. Which carries with it some risks. Actually, this guy sent him to the corner. Reporting. Affirmative. Affirmative. Acknowledge. Reporting. Now, weirdly, tanks can drive really quickly on spice. Construction complete. Acknowledge. As quickly as they can on rock. Affirmative. They're slow on sand, which makes sense. Acknowledge. Rock should be quick. Um, I should not be scouting with a tank. Affirmative. Re acknowledge. Acknowledge. Affirmative. Yeah. Report. Acknowledge. Reporting. On dunes, eh? Let's. Acknowledge. Affirmative. They're not faster, but they have the um, the 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 rocky flag, I guess, because they 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 bump around, they jump around. Affirmative. Acknowledge. 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 That looks normal to me. Affirmative. Re affirmative. Re affirmative. Uh, I should be building. Construction complete. Order harvester deployed. Report acknowledged. Construction complete. Might be infantry because that makes more sense for hills. Construction complete. Now. Construction complete. Yeah, they complete. They should be at least as fast as um troopers. Especially since troopers are carrying a lot more um a lot more equipment. Okay. The enemy's gonna be again left to down. So what I need to do is sort of face my base away from that as much as possible. So I'm gonna start building. Affirmative. Construction complete. Affirmative. Five wide here isn't gonna give me the space that I want for enclosing a repair facility. Yes, sir. Moving in. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. So I'm gonna to have to plan to build the repair facility probably here. Yes, sir. Moving in. I'm gonna park a trooper right on there. So that I don't forget. Construction complete. Which means construction complete. Yeah, they do, because it's the highest value thing, so complete. Which is annoying because if you want to avoid getting it destroyed early, you have to complete. Acknowledge. Hold off on building it for a while. But if you want to enclose that entirely so that you can use um, uh, carryalls entirely for it, you have to mark it out and enclose it over time. 
and then make sure that you don't build it in as well, because if you end up getting a unit dropped in there or um, deployed out of a building in that space, I have to start building some stuff. I'm falling behind here. Bordos harvester deployed. Construction complete. So. I'm going to put that there. What have we got here? Order two, two, and three. Deployed. Light vehicle factory I'll put here. I think the high tech can go here. And then I'll start building... Yeah, I'll start building carryalls. Heavy factory can go down here. And then, I reckon... Construction complete. No, I'm going to put the, high, the heavy factory here. Because the higher up the map that I have it, the sharper the angle is going to be of attack from the enemy base to my base. No, I'm going to put it up here, actually. Oh, I need radar. I should build radar. Got the power for it. Yeah. I was like, wait, wait, why can't I see these fanciful buildings I'm about to build in this list? Um, and yes, yeah, so hearkening back to an earlier point of yours, the radar does reveal a lot of terrain around it. As will be shown in 3, 2, 1. I don't like doing that though, because that is a lot of ground to uncover. And if you do that sort of at the edge of rock, and you uncover an absolute ton of ground, um, that can also include worms. And discovering a worm with that much... It, it, I don't like doing it, because it's just so... I'm so unprepared for it. Alright, I'm gonna go high tech first and gamble that. Reporting. Acknowledged. Cause the first uh the first surprise attack. Acknowledged. The first surprise attack on this level doesn't include rocket uh missile tanks, does it? So I'm kind of gambling, essentially, that I don't need tanks yet. Reporting. Ign yes, sir. Moving out. Construction complete. Right. Start pumping out the carryalls. Yes, moving out. Bordos harvester deployed. Construction complete. For this reason. Affirmative. Now. Construction complete. Construction complete. This is a bit speculative. In fact, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna speculate even further. Construction complete. And put it there. Report affirmative. Acknowledged. Warning. Worm sign. Report Whoop. acknowledged. Okay. Construction. He's going for that one. So what's he gonna do? Is he stuck? No, he's not. He's gonna go around for this. Reporting. Affirmative. Okay. Is there a clear path around this rock? I don't... I think there is. Okay. Maybe there's not. Okay, I have to know this right now. 
Report acknowledged. Re acknowledged. Affirmative. Affirmative. Report affirmative. 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 Re affirmative. Affirmative. Re affirmative. Maybe this rock? Affirmative. Re acknowledged. Acknowledged. Affirmative. Report affirmative. Acknowledged. Acknowledged. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledged. Affirmative. Acknowledged. Report affirmative. Hello, Spice Blue. Affirmative. Affirmative. Um, what have we learned? The worm can get around. Harkonnen unit approaching. Oh, hello. Report affirmative. Our base is under attack. Report acknowledged. Report affirmative. Reporting acknowledged. Harkonnen unit destroyed. So, I think what we're going to need to do is lure the worm back up here. Gosh, we're nearly out of power. Um... Okay, either way. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. I can't afford to get too distracted. Oh. Construction complete. You know what? Just take my infantry. Or just stand there, that's cool too. Gosh, what a time and place for a reinforcement drop. The other useless feature of infantry is when they drop from three units to one, which they do when they drop down to half health, they instantly retreat. Oh really? You're out of range of that. I know it is, thank you. Okay. Warning. Harkonnen unit approaching. Reporting. Affirmative. Affirmative. Oh, that is deeply Bordos unwelcome. Affirmative. Construction complete. <sighs> Uh, can you attack that now, please? Reporting. Acknowledged. Harkonnen unit destroyed. Report affirmative. Harkonnen unit destroyed. Harkonnen unit destroyed. Okay, he's stuck. That's good. I might have misjudged the order of operations here a bit badly. Reporting. Acknowledged. Um, so. Reporting. Reporting. That quad can come down there and go all on launcher duty. Affirmative. Report acknowledged. Report acknowledged. Affirmative. Affirmative. Reporting. Et voila. Acknowledged. Reporting. Acknowledged. Please don't attack. Okay, good. He is just out of range of that. Um, I have to rush tanks now. And then it's going to be a risk that the next enemy um, ambush drop. It is going to include a rocket launcher. And if I'm particularly unlucky, 
exactly the way it drops, I will lose this instantly. Because the heavy factory, which I need to build tanks, will go down in two missile shots. Reporting. Acknowledged. Warning. Falcona unit approaching. So that tank I'm bringing back down. I am just going to leave that guy to do his thing. Now... Our base is under what? attack. Our unit destroyed. Do I need another... Guard quad down here. Where did he come from? Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. It's all a delicate balancing act. I need to be building a million tanks right now. I also need to be building another turret. Construction complete. Ordos unit deployed. Construction complete. Turret's going down. Report acknowledged. So that crod Harkonnen unit destroyed. Crossed this point. So I need to put more concrete down and put down another couple of turrets here. And at that point, these turrets should be able to take care of Every aggressor unit deployed. that emerges. Reporting. Acknowledge. Acknowledge. Reporting. Meanwhile, what I'm doing here is strategically placing these tanks around my heavy factory. Because if a missile tank drops here, for example, and attacks it, complete. it'll take it down in two shots. Which I don't want. Warning, Arcona unit approaching. Okay, is that launcher going to get stuck up on the turrets? Our base is under attack. Construction complete. Ordos unit deployed. Reporting. Affirmative. Okay, good. The Taurus just took out the launcher. Which means these guys aren't as needed. I do need to put down I've misjudged this a little bit. Okay, I'm going to need to leave a tank out here to deal with infantry, strangely enough. Because the launchers will now walk past the turrets and try to attack the rest of the structures. Construction complete. Acknowledged. Affirmative. Uh... Just for fun, let's go explore with that guy. Reporting. Reporting. Acknowledged. Oh. Report. Acknowledged. Acknowledged. Re Acknowledged. Let's leave this Reporting. guy away from his base. Construction complete. Affirmative. Acknowledged. Acknowledged. And now assault him. Reporting. Cool. That's that guy taken care of. That'll just be like a base defense unit that's just been placed around. So getting him out of the way will be nice and easy. Well, it'll be nice. Warning, Harkonnen unit approaching. It's a tank. I'll move the tank out. Warning, worm sign. Okay, chances are good the worm will go and attack some enemy units. Gordos unit destroyed. Acknowledged. 
So that was cool. I just delayed that rocket tech just long enough. Um. Okay, I think this heavy factory is defended enough. Uh... Oh. oh! Here we go, here we go, here we go, this is it. Okay. Uh, first order of business, get at least one shot out on every unit here, so that they stop attacking the structures. Reporting. Reporting. Acknowledged. Reporting. Falcona unit destroyed. Okay. Reporting. Reporting. Report. Affirmative. We lost some concrete, but no units. Destroyed. Reporting. Acknowledged. Reporting. Affirmative. Report. Affirmative. Report. So. I now want to quickly take care of this bloody worm who's just run off. Maybe I can trick him. Report. Affirmative. Affirmative. Warning. Harkonnen unit approaching. Report. Affirmative. Report. Affirmative. Add a room for spice? Build a carryall. Um, actually, yeah, I'm just gonna build carryalls now. Okay, good. This phase of the game could have got a lot worse than that. Construction complete. Bordos unit launched. Construction complete. Yes, I too. I was just getting to that part. Um, we have power. We have carryalls. Let's do it. Construction complete. Bordos unit launched. Everything should be getting neatly eaten up by the turrets. Please, red dot, go away. Harkonnen unit destroyed. Okay, clearly we need to bolster the turrets. Because the problem is, the turrets have to very slowly rotate to attack what they're once nearby, as Harkonnen this guy is doing. Destroyed. Construction. Yeah. Yeah, look, I won't deny this game is easy as it is. Relatively. Um, the relative ease with which I am playing it is born out of literal years playing this game as a kid. And knowing exactly what will happen in response to what. Construction complete. Reporting. Acknowledged. Warning. Harkonnen unit approaching. Oh. I am going to wait until I have a harvester. Reporting. Here we go. Right. And now the ferrying operation begins. Yeah, that's that's kind of nonsense, honestly. Like I realize it's it's designed to be an extra challenge and so on, but that that sort of thing doesn't doesn't interest me, to be honest. Report, 
Like, I don't feel like this game is really fair enough to begin with. Okay, so what I'm doing there is artificially damaging one of my tanks so that... I guess I could have driven him the four squares across to the repair facility, but... Yeah, whatever. The really nice thing is how... So you've mentioned earlier how expensive structures are to repair. Fortunately, tanks cost nothing. Or close to nothing, anyway. Construction complete. Yeah, something super low in any case. Um Got plenty of power. And basically everything else that we could want. Harkona unit destroyed. Unless, no, I'm gonna try something. Bordos harvester deployed. No, I'm gonna do a thing. Reporting. Oh, this explains why my, my money is so low. I'm gonna do a thing that I haven't. It's Order a bit extravagant. That I haven't really tried uh, doing previously. Construction complete. I will use some walls. Reporting. Acknowledged. Construction complete. Warning. But. Harkonnen unit approaching. I am also going to use some useful structures here. Report acknowledged. Affirmative. Construction complete. The reasoning behind my genius will become apparent. But essentially, with... Construction. Yeah, that there is that bug. Unit destroyed. That won't be as much of an issue on this level. Because the these turrets have much lower range. Oh, and clearly one of my units made it right here and died. Reporting. Acknowledged. Affirmative. It's a bug when the regular turrets do it. Acknowledged. Acknowledged. And the other side of that bug, which is that you end up with enemy turrets damaging bits of your base because they went to fire on one of those things one of the one of your carriers that is near your uh, near their base affirmative affirmative acknowledge Harkonnen unit destroyed okay reporting affirmative i've gotten this level to the point where i've affirmative I have free reign at this Reporting. point, really. Acknowledge. Affirmative. The enemy can't attack me. Because <clears throat> their units go straight towards these turrets and just die immediately. I didn't intentionally place them in the formation of an F, but whatever. Construction complete. So here's what I'm doing. Warning. This is super extravagant. I've never had two repair facilities before. I'm walling in this last one because I can't place structures here because there's not enough space. Um, I'm going to leave this quarter here. There's like a low value construction complete. Sacrificial unit, I guess. It's not. It's not going to be blown up. It's not going to be attacked. But it's going to plug the hole. I'm going to build. 
Oh, you know what? Yeah, because I can't build something there. Construction complete. Gonna build up another couple of harvesters. I've got enough spice sands to maintain building an army for a while. We've already had two surprise attacks, so I don't need to worry at all about what's happening with the base. Acknowledged. Reporting. Acknowledged. Reporting. They do, which is why I'm only going to build one extra. Acknowledged. Especially because they need to Reporting. maintain the plug quad. Reporting. Acknowledged. So now. Acknowledged. Affirm. Acknowledged. And I'm very intentionally not looking at that quad. So that it moves slower. Reporting. And my turrets have time. If I'm if I was looking here when that happened, all I would see Order is a quad drive forward. straight past the turrets because they'd be very slowly turning to face it. Reporting. Affirmative. Uh, how are we doing? Another carry all. We're we doing for tanks. We're not at the limit. Acknowledged. Now. Warning, Arcona unit approaching. You're a little bit lower to power. And by low I mean it's 60% utility. Unit launched. Construction complete. So I'm going to throw up another power plant. Complete. And it's going to be the last structure that I bother building on this map. Reporting. Acknowledged. Construction complete. Reporting. Yeah, but the problem with that. Reporting. Acknowledge. Affirmative. I don't like doing that. I. <laughs> okay, this is why I never really played with MCVs. Acknowledge. And it's because if you do that, if you're going to go to that length, you may as well just cheese it completely and build turrets all the way up to their base. Acknowledged. Reporting. Acknowledged. Our current unit destroyed. Affirmative. Report. Affirmative. Enemy structure destroyed. Affirmative. Ordos unit Oh, that destroyed. was nicely done. I don't like doing it, especially when a base that's in the middle of being built is so fragile to begin with. Reporting. Acknowledged. Okay, we're about at the limit for these things. Construction complete. Ordos unit deployed. Reporting. Acknowledged. Going to use my scout trikes to disturb the enemy. Harkona unit destroyed. Harkona unit destroyed. Reporting. Affirmative. Affirmative. Report acknowledged. Affirmative. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledged. Warning. Harkona unit approaching. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Okay, we're looking for enemy units who we can disturb. Affirmative. Reporting. Oh. Acknowledged. Put out some turrets. Affirmative. Acknowledge. 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 Yeah, the rocket launches I'm not too worried about. Affirmative. 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 Acknowledge. I'll sit here for a second. Report. No. Affirmative. Acknowledge. I was hoping to get pretty lucky with the uh, rockets. Acknowledge. Report. Affirmative. Ordos unit destroyed. Oh, that was close.
That was very nearly a replacement carry-all required. Okay, how are we doing for spice? And we got one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so we can store up to 6,000 credits. So we're good there. Report affirmative. Acknowledged. Report acknowledged. Reporting. Affirmative. Acknowledged. Hopefully we're not close enough to... Oh, we are. Okay. Reporting. So I'm keeping the stuff that's off to the left out of sight. Because there is another rocket launcher on its way. And I want this thing dead before it gets there. Reporting. Harkonnen unit destroyed. Okay. Acknowledged. Harkonnen unit destroyed. Harkonnen unit destroyed. Acknowledged. 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 Report affirmative. Warning. Harkonnen unit approaching. Harkonnen unit destroyed. Okay. Harkonnen so they haven't rebuilt their heavy destroyed. factory yet. Um, construction yard is very deep in the base. We're gonna have to go in from the north again. We're gonna take losses. But they're not building any more tanks. They do... Okay, here's the thing I don't know about the AI rebuilding structures. Okay. The question was going to be whether they place them over their own units in addition to mine. And the answer is yes, yes they do. Alright. Let's get this party started. for tanks we can build and let's build another carryall just just for fun they don't count against the ground unit limit report affirmative reporting acknowledge report acknowledge report affirmative construction complete construction complete Bordos unit launched affirmative do they? Okay. Report, Can't report, say I've ever hit the report, air unit limit. Report, reporting. Affirm, re, affirm, re, acknow, report, affirmative. Report, affirm, re, report, affirm, re, affirmative. Report, affirmative. Warning, Harkonnen unit approaching. Ig, report, acknow, report, acknowledged. Reporting, affirmative. Report, acknow, report, acknowledged. Harkonnen unit destroyed. Okay. Sneaking along as sneakily as a pile of tanks can be in the desert. We've left one behind already. Palace the deployed, we don't want that. Harkonnen unit destroyed. Reporting. Hmm. Yeah, that's interesting, but I don't really have the units to do anything about that. This is already a much higher value uh, movement. So this is what I mean. I'm glad that as stupid as it sounds, the unit limit works really well for this game, simply because you can't select enough units for it to make a difference. These guys are gonna keep moving. Keep moving, please. 
Report acknowledged. Report affirmative. Report acknowledged. Reporting affirmative. Reporting. Uh, Socket of opportunity on the way. Reporting affirmative. Reporting acknowledged. Report affirmative. Boros unit destroyed. Our base is. I'm not getting through that fast enough. Reporting. Report. Report. Okay. Report. Report. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Report. Acknowledged. Enemy structure destroyed. Crap. He's in range of that. Report. Acknowledged. Reporting. Boros vehicle repaired. Take that out. Please. Reporting. Affirmative. Okay. Unit destroyed. Report. Affirmative. Acknowledged. Report. Acknowledged. Enemy structure destroyed. Is he in range of the turret? Not yet. Acknowledged. Arcona unit destroyed. Ordos vehicle repaired. Take out the factory! Okay. Ordos unit destroyed. Next target is this turret. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Acknowledged. Reporting. Ordos vehicle repaired. There goes a carry-all. Right. Get out of the range of the turret, get rid of this tank. Quad's gonna go. Tank, 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 tank. Harkonnen unit destroyed. Harkonnen unit destroyed. Reporting. I don't know that I'm going to do it with five tanks. Four. Shit. Shit. Yeah. Yep, okay, this is doomed. But, we did a lot. Ordos vehicle repaired. Reporting. Okay, we had one turret, uh, one tank drop back here, pointlessly. <gasps> Hello! I forgot I had these guys. Report affirmative. Affirmative. Report acknowledged. Construction complete. Reporting. Affirmative. Ordos unit destroyed. Acknowledged. Reporting. Acknowledged. Reporting. Acknowledged. Report. Acknowledged. 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 He's not out of range there. Okay. Ah, uh, he'll be in range of that turret though. Acknowledged. Reporting. Acknowledged. Harkona unit destroyed. Alright, we're gonna attack this, then we're gonna take out this tank, and then turn around and kill the war. Enemy structure destroyed. Will he, won't he? Yes. That's it. Um. Report acknowledged. Report affirmative. Report acknowledged. Report affirmative. Ordos vehicle repaired. Affirmative. Report affirmative. Reporting affirmative. I think we will need some more. Some more tanks. Enemy structure destroyed. Now, we have to do some slightly careful maneuvering because I don't want to have to deal with any more turrets. Yeah, he's in range, he's got to go. Should be out of range of that one. Is he out of range of that one? Yes.
I don't think I can get enough tanks in range of the outpost yet to do anything to it. Construction complete. Unit destroyed. What have we got here? This turret we can rush. Yeah, I think we have to do that. Range like on that turret. Shit, it can shoot in that square. And there. Okay. thing was to get that turret so everything here is opened up. Um, this one we might have to rush as well. But for now... If we can take out this refinery, we can sneak around, take out the launcher. Oh, really mate? Unit destroyed. What? Enemy structure destroyed. Oh, because it dropped a tank there. Unit destroyed. Okay. The carriels dropped a tank exactly where it needed to be to take out their harvester. Not that them still harvesting makes any difference at this point, because there's no production vehicles, uh, production structures left. I don't attack Okay. Yeah, so the, the sorry state of some of these buildings is because those turrets, um, they don't stop attacking until they fire a shot after their target has gone out of range. Which is some hilarious garbage. Why are you not attacking this building? It's also worth mentioning there's no mechanism in this game to sell vehicles or structures, um, and the AI at no point will do anything vaguely called surrender. Even if the last structure standing is a spice silo, um, you have to destroy it. The game does not end until that point. So what do we got left? This refinery and an outpost. So Alright. Reporting. Time for some stupid stuff. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Report reporting. Acknowledge. Acknowledge. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirm affirm affirmative. Warning. Harkona unit approaching. Reporting. Acknowledge. Report. Acknowledge. Report. Acknowledge. Reporting. Reporting. Report. Affirmative. Affirmative. Reporting. Affirmative. 
Affirmative. Report affirmative. Ordos vehicle repaired. Now with this structure gone, we might as well rush the this turret. I don't think that tank's coming back. Carriels have done their magic and forgotten where they were meant to bring it. Which is a problem because I don't think four tanks are going to bring down a um, radar outpost. It's way too heavily armored for some reason. So we're going to rush this turret. Which these four tanks absolutely can do. Enemy structure destroyed. We're going to do the same to this turret. Reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. Ignal. Reporting. Ignal. Reporting. Ignal. Reporting. Affirmative. So, I don't know. Can they do this without getting in? No, they can't. Not from there, anyway. So. Our base is under attack. Ordos vehicle repair. It is happening. It is happening just fast enough. Four tanks is enough. As long as I don't look away. Talk among yourselves. Enemy structure destroyed. And that Our should be it. Unit destroyed. Your mission is complete. Now I get the star board, yeah. So, the rank is meaningless, but based on what score you get. There's basically a lookup table based on this range of score gets this rank, essentially. Yeah, if you're off to bed, I might call this anyway. I don't think anyone else is actually watching, so... I'm going to jump into the next mission, save the game, and we'll call it there. Yeah, we'll see this next time. So, actually, I'm not going to. Before the next stream, I'm going to load that game again. I am going to quickly have a look at... Actually, you know what? No, I'm going to use this map. Disregard all of that. I'm going to quit. I'm going to finish. Thanks very much for watching. Um, yeah, you too. You have a good Easter. Um, thanks for hanging out. This has been really fun. Um, yeah. Talk to you later. Thanks for watching.